Hello and welcome to Max Payne 3, the final in our, our trilogy. That, as you can see, we're not starting in the... Well, for understandable reasons, we're not starting in the uh, the happiest of situations, but... I mean, surely... Surely everything will be... Will end on a really nice, happy... Will live happily ever after, right? Right? And have more bad things happen to Max, right? Right? No, we, we would have wanted to go old school, but we can't get there, so... How about we... How about we make this playthrough last twice as long as it has to by playing on hard? There's quite a difference in uh, graphics, I don't know... I should have looked up how many years there is. This place is great. In between really comfortable. second and third one. It's also the first game where the where Max Payne is actually modeled after James McCaffrey. I'm just gonna get settled in. Time to move on. Get on with my life. Yes, absolutely. And maybe it's just a, a life sim where we're just Hanging out, getting a regular job, paying bills, watching TV. No bad things happen, no gunfights, no loved ones lost. So that now, would be nice. Like I said, it was a long time ago. Let it go, seriously. We need more noir narration in video games. I'm totally not biased on that. Definitely more my style than Panama or Hoboken, I guess. No, if I'm honest, I just got kind of bored of boozing. I mean, once in a while. Not all the time. Yeah, you gotta mix it up. You're right. It wasn't doing me any favors. Maybe I'd lost my self-respect, but it's back. I'm excited. Really. I really needed a new start. In this peaceful place. It's certainly right. It certainly ain't New Jersey. It's my new life, just like you said. Listen, you think I can still do a job? What have I got to lose? Uh. Apart from the weight. Very funny. Ha ha. Yes, that is a fake laugh, you jerk. This game is the first one, which I've mentioned earlier, that I actually saw a playthrough of. I was like, I gotta play Max Payne. But that was so long ago, I can't remember what happens and how things go. Which I'm sure is because it was so, so happy that it didn't scar me or anything. So, yeah, everything's going to be great for Max. Come on, please. It's a Kong whiskey. I think we saw that in. Didn't we see uh, not billboards, but like big posters in the uh, subway system for that? This doesn't sound like happy, fun times music.
I, he's certainly not having a happy fun time. What they wanted me to be. A killer. Oh, Some geez. rent a clown with a gun who puts holes in other bad guys. Well, that's what they had paid for, so in the end, that's what they got. Say what you want about Americans, but we understand capitalism. Speaking of the difference in graphics. You get what you pay for. And these chumps had paid for some angry gringo without the sensibilities to know right from wrong. Here I was about to execute this poor bastard like some dime store angel of death. And I realized they were correct. I wouldn't know right from wrong if one of them was helping the poor and the other was banging my sister. We've gone international. A few weeks before, I was working a protection detail for the kind of people who need protection in a town like this. And what kind of town was this? One where I didn't speak the language and they didn't water down their drinks. So for now, we seem to get along just fine. Of course, that was about to change. Of course. Hey, brother. Hey. How's the cocktail? Scotch. I never mix my drinks. He's not on duty. Something like that. Man, that favela is big. Yep. Nothing like the view of extreme poverty to make a penthouse cocktail party really swing. I guess they call it trickle-down economics. <laughs> That's funny. It's supposed to be a charity thing. Drink and give money. I don't know. Something for the kids. Hey, listen, man. You better look lively. This place is a nightmare. We just got cowboys running security downstairs. Something rotten in the air. That didn't mean much. There was always something rotten in the air. Yeah, life has not been uh, smooth sailing, has it? Rich parasites with delusions of humanity. The kind of people who end up in glossy magazines or body bags, depending on how their luck I mean, runs. We're in a Max Payne game. So where are they all? I see Rodrigo over there talking. I think it's rather one-sided how things are going to go. That guy next to him. Some kind of cop. Uh, I think, I'm not sure. Serious though. A big end cop. Anti gang sort of stick. I can't remember his name. Who's this guy? That guy's a plastic surgeon or some kind of surgeon. A tummy tucks and cock implants. Ha! Look at Marcel. Still dances like a fool. Guess that's what a European education and a co capital do for Ricky Martin look alike. <laughs> that's very funny, Max. Oh, excuse me. I was mostly working for Rodrigo Branco. So who of all these names are, are worth things. remembering and who will be dead in like three minutes time? Him, won awards, owned things, people. One of the trophies he had won was his wife, Fabiana. She was hot and wanted to be dangerous. Some good genes trying to fight their way out of a cesspit. She'd married well and was now at leisure to regret her good fortune. They got along as well as any rich workaholic and his younger airhead wife tend to get along. They mostly ignored each other. She spent a lot of time with his cokehead younger brother, Marcello. He was a good time guy if your idea of a good time was an expensive suit, a bottle of champagne, and nothing between the ears. The middle brother, Victor, had just walked in. He was a local politician. The guy was smoother than an oil slick on an iceberg and about as toxic. The rest of the crowd, I didn't know. That's a saying. But I could imagine the types. People who know if they drink enough, they won't have to feel guilty about their good fortune. Suddenly, things turned real ugly. Felt like our hangovers arrived right on cue. You can tell it's bad news because the music stopped. The record. Because apparently they're still playing those. I say, having a record player right next to me. I think we're about to go now. Things had gone from fine to fucked up in about a second, and now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. Hey, uh, friend, are, are are you gonna make it out? We have a bad record with people dying. 
trophy wife or not. I'd said I would protect the girl. I hoped I hadn't lost my edge, along with everything else. Whoop. Up. Up. Oh, thanks you were in the way. Can we... Like, whoop. Excellent. Oh, I see pills. That was the boss lady. Only this time she wasn't calling for more vodka in her Cosmo. I guess it's probably on our side, is it? But we're very... Probably not here either. Uh oh. Maybe it was outside. She was out on one of the balconies. Thank you. <laughs> and I hoped not about to be thrown off it. Oh, okay. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Let her go. Let her go. Come on. Oh, are we jumping off? It might have been stupidity or drunkenness, or maybe both. Well, I'm behind the wheel, so it's stupidity. Taking insane risks. Trying to save fallen women. Here we go. Oh. Oh, that's gonna ruin our suit. I better get a pay raise for that. Come on. Hey, you need a hand? No, you. Who the hell's Rodrigo? That's the most badass thing you're gonna see in like a decade. I mean, not for me. I'm gonna do even more amazing things, but like you guys. And then we died of being crushed by an elevator door. The elevator door is opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Where you got Where did you go? Oh, oh we, we have cover, okay. It helps you that y'all are wearing masks. That lets me know who to shoot. And then cue to exit. Once Bronco was out, still the tab. Door, all bets were off. I had to keep moving. Oh, I, I don't know if shotgun is a good idea. Okay. I feel like there's a lot more buttons involved in this one. Some nice pellets. I think he's dead. I think I think we're good. I think we're good. You wouldn't happen to have a rifle, would you? Oh jeez. Okay. How am I gonna remember all these? It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Actually, I have several of them. I'm gonna Rodrigo need all of them. was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. Oh. I shot in between because I thought I still had the uh, shotgun. Nope. Yes. Apparently we have melee. We're gonna die so many times on this, but we knew that already. Are we... Flashing doors, gotcha. Like I should. The control box was on the wall to the left of the gate. I think I'd rather have the pistols than the. Mm, I don't know actually. 
Because the shotgun does go the distance. You're still around it, dude. You. Lead. Search for clues. You're gonna have to be a bit more specific they were than that. On my say so. I had to move. The great thing about being famous as well as rich is the bad guys know who to kidnap. Okay. Another parking. We got some detective in to our noir. Was I too late? Whoa. I didn't mean to wreck your, uh, I was about to say hydration system. That's not what that's used for. Oh no, now he's wearing a mask too. I might just end up shooting him. Yeah, I know how to deal with cars. I thought I ran out of ammo. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, you're a bit slippery, Max. I, I think we got him. Max, stop. No, no. He's dead, Max. He's dead. I did not expect us to actually be able to save them. Fuck. You did good, Max. Good? That's an understatement. Don't look so good. Hey, what could be better, huh? The good guys are reunited, and the Commando Sombra are dead. I guess. So who's this guy? I don't know. Some kind of cop. Different branch of the police. Not Ufe, but uh, normal cops. I don't know about this stuff, politics. Everywhere politics. Shit, Max, you look kind of beat up. I, I killed like 30 people. Of course I'm a bit... <laughs> and I have bullet holes on me. Which is bad news, because they're not on the uh, back of our suit. So they're in there somewhere. Back home, it was time for some R&R. &R, the only way I knew how. A bath and a book. Also, I knew we weren't in America because the pill bottles aren't orange. Oh, earthquake. So is ready for bed. <laughs> oh, Max. Oh, no, you left the milk out. And the helicopter. A couple of days later, it was back to work. Ferrying the boss's broad and his dipshit of a brother out for the night so they could recover from their brush with mortality. Yeah, then party in, partying in a helicopter seems like a good idea. Who went to nightclubs and helicopters. One stumble and you're out the door. Fabiana had brought her sister along, presumably so she could show off just how rich and empty her life was. And boy, was she about to learn the meaning of rich and empty. Max! Max! 
Sorry, I was internally monologuing. We? Do you have a suit full of bullet holes? The game is not over yet, so don't. Even more time doing something useful. <laughs> you know she works in the favela, and she's the good sister. Oh, shut up. <laughs> what did you hear, Baba? More bodies turned up, more people went missing. But it's horrifying. Did someone say Buzz Q? Hey. I'm just kidding. But it is a cool town, man. Hey, here we are. Ooh. Oh, her body's flying. place to hang you know do a little business have some fun i need it too i've been working far too hard like a whore during fleet wiki as my roommate used to say <laughs> you like that max that's pretty funny So many people that are about to be dead in three, two. Max is like, finally, this is my kind of place. I can let loose and just feel the music. I hope you like effects, because we have all of them. That's a fancy way of calling them NPCs. So far, we hang on for dear life. Listening to music I can't stand. I'm 5,000 miles from home. I'm armed and I'm drinking. You don't want to listen to advice from me, amigo. <laughs> Man, you're fucking real, you know? You have no idea. People, fuck them. People get me wrong. I think, I think I love a wrong woman. Fabio, Fabio, my nigga. Oh, jeez. Thank God he has left. A minute more of his drivel, and I would have to put a bullet in him myself. It soon turned out. I wasn't the only one. I have a feeling maybe someone will do that for you. I 
I thought someone was just gonna snipe him, like through the window. Oh, how many can... Up. Oop. Oop. I missed them. Oh, there's one more dude up there. 